good morning students in this lecture we are going to solve one example for the completely randomized design in last lecture we have studied about the principles of completely randomized design let's have a look on completely randomized design here completely randomized design is useful for laboratory experiment where material is homogeneous and each unit receiving the same treatment we can use this type of experiment in lab as well as the greenhouse studies where environmental effects are easy to control today we go with the help of one uh, table of random number how we can design a final layout of the experiment so we are with this data of uh, random numbers and sequence is given right from 1 to the 20 so how the design of final layout of experiment can be done so for this first step is to give the rank n for the random numbers so, so same uh, random numbers we have to just give them the ranks right from ascending to the descending order so here right from 1 to the 20 we have given them the ranks in step second what we have to do divide these ranks already we have given the 20 ranks and they are divided into the t number of groups so here we have divided them into the four groups and each consisting of r numbers so in each group there are the five numbers so here we are with these two uh, total four groups and each group is with these five numbers and the last step for this final layout assign t treatments to the n plots by using the group number so for first group we have assigned the treatment a for group second the treatment b group third that is uh, treatment c and group four that re treatment d and each treatment is with these uh, five numbers so there is equal distribution this is the final layout of experiment after assigning the ranks and giving the treatments. so four treatments like a b c d are replicated for five times so you can observe here this a is replicated for five times here each treatment is with different color is shown and important to note that each treatment is replicated equal times and again that randomized in final layout of the x-men like this for any random numbers we can finalize the layout of a x -men. Next lecture we go for the ANOA. Thank you.